Hello, let's do the New York Times Hard Sudoku for December 15th, 2023. There's a link in the description if you'd like to try the puzzle yourself, and I'm going to get started right now. All right, we have two threes and two eights. So two threes look into here. It's a three in one of those. Two eights look over here. There's an eight over here. Two nines look over here. This nine looks up. It's a nine in one of those two. Uh, sevens. Hmm. Not seeing anything else to do here. Got the one. All right, let's 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 move on. We have two ones looking into here. This one looks up, so one's one of those two. Hmm. Two twos look down. This two looks up. We can place this two. Okay, these two twos look up. That places the two here. What are these two digits? Um, three and five. All right, we have this five looking over, so that's three, that's five. Nice, we just finished this column entirely. Um, you got the twos, nines look in. There's a nine, one of those two. Um, I wanna, I'm gonna look at this vertical real quick because yeah, like the six looking up, we'll put a six over here. This four looking up, we'll put a four here. The two, uh, the twos are done. The eight looking down, we'll put an eight there. This is a triple, three, five, seven, and the bottom, oops, not five, sorry, three, seven, nine, the bottom can't be nine. So the seven goes in one of those two. That is gonna point left along with this seven looking right. It's a seven up here. These can't be seven, because these point. Um, and what that means is like, if you just think about it, if this were a seven, where would we put seven in this box? And the answer is nowhere, and that's not allowed, because the box needs a seven. So that means we can say that seven's only up here in this box. All right, um, moving back up to where I was, I think I was doing this band, but I also think I may have finished doing this band. Well, we just got this three. Okay, so the three is in one of these two. Uh, I got this two, does that help? Not that I can tell. Got this five. Also nothing. Okay. Um, nines. Well, this is avoiding the one, eight, and nine. So this is down to two digits. What are they? One, two, three, four. We need a five. We need a seven. Can't be eight or nine. Okay. That might come in handy if we find another five, seven. <laughs> um, let's see, down here. Okay, we got two ones looking into this box and two ones looking down into the box. And so there's a one exactly here. That's where one goes. Um, there's a four and a four. So four goes in there somewhere. I think that's all we're getting for those horizontals. All right, let's go vertical. Two ones look up. This one looks in, so there's a one up here. Uh, nines might, oh, we already got nines though. <laughs> Never mind. Nines downwards? No. Ones, twos. Not really seeing anything else to do here. Guess we'll move on. Um, one, three, eight, nine. So the nines look down. Um, eight's not quite good enough. The ones we got. I think that's all we get there too. Okay, uh, and we already did this for this vertical. I don't think anything new has happened since then. Okay, so we got to look for restricted cells like these ones and this one. Um, cells with three or fewer candidates. Um, what is a prime location to look? Honestly, there aren't really good locations to look. Um, trying to see. Is this row interesting? Let's just think about the row. I mean, I'm seeing the nines over here, so and the three here, I don't know. Um, one, three, five, six, eight, nine. Oof. One, three, five, one, three, five, six. That's too many. 
because it's not a one. Okay, just three, five, six, eight, nine. Just three, five, six, eight, nine. Um, these aren't five or nine. So we need three. Can't be five, six, eight, nine. Oh, not nine, sorry, because there's nine in the box. And this eight looks down. So we get some restricted cells there. This can't be nine, but that's that's it. Uh, I guess I should look at this column. So we found a three, six in it. Um, what do we need in the column? We need two, three, six, seven. Wait, I missed something, right? Uh, two, three, no, yeah, one more. Two, three, four, six, seven. Um, let's see. This can't be four or seven because we have the yeah we have the four and the seven. Or the two. Oh, okay. Yeah, actually, if you look at it, we've got the one, four, seven looking at this cell. And we've also got one four, one, four, seven looking at this cell. So it's going to have the same result. Oh, but what about nine? Oh, and nine is here. Yeah, there's a nine in the column. Why did I think nine was interesting? Oh, for the row, nine was interesting. Oh, I see. Oh, maybe. Let's just look. Okay, I think it's three, six, though. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, this is three, six. So the rest of this column is a triple. Uh, we need a two, four, seven. Okay, two, four, seven. Oh, this can't be seven because of the sevens here. So we have a two, four pair. So this is a seven. Okay. Um, So let's look at this row, which now has four left. Um, we need two, three. This can't be two, three. Oh, and we need a nine. So this is the other digit. This is eight. So we have two, three, nine over here. This, that places the nine, because this two, three. Places this nine. This is a two, three pair. So what's this triple? One, two, three, four. We need five, six, and eight. These aren't eight, so that's an eight. Um, we've got this five six pair looking right, so this can't be one two three five six seven eight nine. Yeah, so this is this is only four. That's a two. We can clean that up. That's a four now. This is now avoiding a bunch of corner marks. So what can it be? It could be a one. Can't be two three four. I think it could be five six. Seven, eight, nine. Okay, so one five only. For some reason I thought it would be a single, but it's not. Um three seven nine here, not a seven, so three nine. Okay. Let's take a step back. We just got a bunch of stuff. We got the seven, the four. Um we got this eight. Okay, so let's look at this column then. So one, two, three, four. We need five, six, seven. Yeah, this sees the five, six. Interesting. So that's a seven. These can't be sevens. Ah, oh, that seven gives us this five. What's that too? I guess this row might be interesting now. One, two, we need three. Uh four. Three, four, and eight. Yeah, this can't be three or eight. So that's the four. That's a three, six, eight triple. That puts a six in one of these two. And then this is also a single. That's a four. Fours are doing pretty well. Um, I guess they're over here. Let's see. This is a pair at best. Uh, one, two, three, four. We need five and six. Okay, it is a pair. Okay, getting there. What, what does this box need? Two. Five, six, seven. I'm just going to mark it at this point, two, five, six, seven. It's not very interesting, but it will be soon, I'm sure. Um, this needs to be from three, five, six, nine. Okay, any of those? I'm missing something to mark here. Is it these sixes that point? Is that helpful? Uh, it means six is up here somewhere. So this can't be six. Maybe we should think about this row. This row needs a three, five, six, eight, nine. 
I'm not super excited about that, to be honest. All right, I missed something. How about this box? This box needs one, seven, eight, nine. So the seven's up here. Wait. Ah, oh, yeah, so one and seven look in. We need a one and seven in this box. They go here, meaning this can't be an eight. If this was an eight, we'd have to squeeze one and seven both here. So that's not going to work. So that places the eight and the nine. Um, this can't be eight, which does place this eight. This is now a full three, six pair, which does place the three here. It's also going to place this digit because it's the last one for the row. It's a five. That's a six and a five. That's not a nine. Nine's now point up. Not that that's helpful anymore. Um, this can't be six anymore. That places the six and the eight here. That places the eight and the four. That places the four, the three, and the six. Nice. That places five. Okay, none of these are five. That's not a six. There we go. Now these markings are more reasonable. Uh, now that we're finishing. <laughs> um, three, nine pair. Okay, that's a one and a seven. This is a six now. That's three, nine, and five. We get the nine and the three, the six and the three. This is one or five. Can't be five though. I missed that. Uh, that's a six. That's a one, five, two, seven, six. And then we need two and seven. And we're done. All right, well, that collapsed quickly. Um, I mean, it seems like seems like this column collapsed uh, in a way that I didn't expect. Um, so probably that was key. Uh, we found we found this three six pair in this column, or you could have found a hidden two four seven <laughs> triple. I guess I'm not. I mean, yeah, it's what kind of what I was talking about, where you have two four seven looking at this cell, and then we had two four seven looking at this cell from the very start. This column needs a two four seven, and they go there. I'm I'm not sure how to scan for that. That's tough. You just gotta just think about what the column needs, and then notice that. Um, or you can notice the, the naked three six pair once you've penciled some stuff. So, but that is there right from the start. So that and then, uh, it only placed stuff because we also had located the sevens in this box to be in the top row, which eliminated seven from there, which made this the only place for seven. So that, that's kind of an interesting interaction there. Um. So yeah, let me know if that was also key for you or if you had a different way through. And of course, if you enjoyed this content, why not leave a like, subscribe, and a kind comment below.